After hearing broadcaster Erwin Tulfo's apology for an on-air tirade against him, DSWD Secretary Rolando Bautista says Tulfo can and should do more to prove his sincerity. Bautista, among other things, wants Tulfo, first of all, to put his contrition in black and white, publish it in all major broadsheets, no less than half a page each. He wants to see it on various social media platforms as well. And the DSWD chief asked Tulfo to donate to 19 organizations of Bautista's choosing at least 300,000 pesos. Not clear if Bautista meant 300,000 pesos each or in total, but he suggested that the donations to charity will be in lieu of him seeking greater damages in a potential defamation suit. Bautista, a former general, was publicly berated by Tulfo for not immediately granting an interview on Tulfo's radio show last week. This triggered tremendous backlash from members of the military and eventually, so far, at least two attempts at an apology from Erwin Tulfo. Beyond his apologies, Erwin Tulfo may also have to surrender his firearms. That's now the latest word from the PNP. The police stressed that they have not cancelled nor revoked his license, but national police officials said Tulfo's license to own and carry a gun has already expired. LTAP lang yung nag-expire. Yung license mismo ng firearms are still valid. A notice has already been sent to his last known address um, recalling his uh, registered firearms. Because before you can keep or own or possess firearms, even if these are registered, you need to be a, a holder of a license to own and possess firearms. Tulfo supposedly can and may uh, renew his license as soon as the Comelex nationwide gun ban is lifted on June 12. The broadcaster is expected to turn in his firearms to the nearest police station, if not at the Firearms and Explosives Office itself. Should Tulfo ignore the PNP's orders, police said they will have the option to ask for a search warrant from the Supreme Court.